<laughs> All right, now I have my uh, avocado here, and you can just take your infamous spoon and you can MacGyver your way into the avocado. Boom. So look at that. Pretty easy. Uh, when you buy uh, when you buy avocados, um, they should be pretty soft. See if you can see. Um, my finger pushes in it quite easily. If it's really hard, then you have to wait for it. Then they're no good. You want it to be soft when you make Matt Guyver sauce. Okay. All right. Let's pop, let's pop this puppy open. There we go. Got most of it out. There we go. And then you can just kind of break it up. And uh, I'll finish up that uh, lid. I don't think you really want to watch all of that. You can also use a fork to help mush this up. I think a fork's probably a better idea. So mash, mash, mash. You want to do this fast because that's what MacGyver would do. Dun 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 If you haven't figured it out by now, I live in an RV because my mother kicked me out of the basement. So this is my RV. This is where I'll be cooking all of my episodes from for many, many, many months. Uh, all right, so we have our guacamole thoroughly mushed. I just put one, or I mean, it's not guacamole yet, it's avocado, but I put one in there. You could put two in if you want, but I wanna save, I wanna save the other one. So now I'm just going to put in the onions and uh, and the garlic. See, see, looks good. So you just dump that in there into your mac guac guyver because uh, us geeks we like MacGyver. He's pretty cool because he does cool things with Swiss Army knives, and duct tape. Dental floss and aspirin. He's pretty, pretty cool, if you know what I mean. So now I'm just here. Let me show you. I'm sure you want to see this. This is highly stimulating. Um, maybe I should add the other avocado. What do you think? There's quite a bit of onions in there. Um, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and add the other avocado MacGyver style. I just added a second avocado. Now I have my can of stewed tomatoes. You can use chopped tomatoes. That's probably better. But uh, but we're going to use this stuff. So I'm going to add some tomatoes. Well, we're not going to put the whole can in there. Maybe what would MacGyver do? WWMD. What would MacGyver do? Would he add this much? Oh, MacGyver gave me the power to figure out. Ah, oh, yeah. Check it out. See, now we have five pieces. One, two, three, four, and one in the middle makes five. Like on a dice, or on a die, when there's the five, this organizational design is called a quincunx. Quincunx. I just like the word quincunx. So that's your word of the day. Quincunx. <laughs> All right, so I stirred in my quincunx of tomatoes into my two avocados, which also has half an onion and some garlic which we had removed the uh, heads and the butts of each of the garlic pieces. So now, the fun part, we're going to add uh, 
spices. How's that look? Oh yeah. So we're going to add soy sauce. Soy sauce and avocado go together like bread and butter. So don't be shy with the soy sauce. So some soy sauce. Uh, you can use lemon juice, or you could use a fresh lemon or a fresh lime. Lime is preferable because green and green and green go together. Green avocado, green uh, lime, but our onion was white. Oh well. But we're going to put a little bit of lemon juice there for some zesty appeal. And some peanuts. This gives it a nice little crunchiness. We always like crunchy things to our food. Uh, so, what kind of spices can we put in here? We're going to put in some uh, parsley, because remember parsley is good for uh, your libido. Put in a buttload of parsley. A little bit of oregano. And we're going to put some more garlic powder because we love garlic powder. And since I love salt, I'm going to add some salt. But this is uh, half, half the sodium of table salt. So you can add twice as much. And it's all good. There we go. And I think I might be out of black pepper. Nope, got a little bit black pepper. And you can always add... Uh, a little bit of cumin, <laughs> ground cumin seed. Not too much. Now, another thing you can add, which kind of gives it a nice smoky flavor, is um, um, seeds. Sunflower seeds. So I'm just going to put a little dab in there. These are salted. So there you go. So there's our Matt Glockgyver. Uh, I had to add a little more salt. And uh, um, I also added a little olive oil. That gives it a nice shininess. Um, so if you, uh, if you have like a Voyager Marathon party with your friends, you can make some Mac Guacgyver. Of course, if you watch MacGyver, you must eat Mac Guacgyver. And what's really good with Mac Guacgyver is the Guaca Chip. And this is the original Guaca Chip, Guacamole Chip, Guacamole Flavored Tortilla Chips made with real avocados. So I'm going to try one right now. I'm kind of ambidextrous, but not always. So you can watch me eat my Mac Guacgyver sauce with uh, original guaca chip. Mmm. That's good. What I'm going to do is put this in the freezer for about 20-30 um, minutes and uh, it'll be better even cold. So then I can watch some Voyager and some MacGyver, and uh, there you go. Have a good day. Bye-bye.